School districts are required to report COVID infections among students and staffers, but we wanted to learn more about the process when a teacher tests positive. Here's Channel 5's Stephanie Rosales. It's all new at 10. Students are not the only ones required to stay home after coming in contact with COVID-19. This applies to teachers as well, but only for those who have not been vaccinated. Those who have been vaccinated have to quarantine for 10 days, leaving administrators having to fill those positions. Other districts like South Texas ISD requires faculty and staff to do screenings each day to show if they are experiencing any COVID symptoms. Whether or not they have to stay home varies from case to case. It's all different um, scenarios laid out within the plan. So if they have symptoms, but they haven't tested positive, if they have symptoms and then they test negative. So we've got all the different scenarios laid out so that there's not that confusion. At BISD, teachers have the option to participate in rapid testing, but it is not required. Rapid testing is available for all students and staff across 54 campuses at BISD. They scan the test. Results are available just 15 minutes after testing. One, two, three, four, five. I received my negative result through email as well as through text message. We, we go by the negative results and if the, the staff is having any symptoms. If the staff is having any symptoms, then they do need to stay home. BISD and South Texas ISD will continue updating all requirements to follow CDC guidelines. Both districts are also requiring masks for everyone inside their buildings. In Brownsville, Stephanie Rosales, Channel 5 News at 10.